Hey guys, my name is Cats Games. Welcome back to Grand Theft Auto Chinatown Wars. Uh, it's been a while since the last episode, probably like two days or three days, but at least it's not fucking three weeks this time. And yeah, first thing we're gonna check is emails. We got an email from Chan. Wang, I've told my father all about you. He's looking forward to meeting you. It's best not to keep him waiting. See you soon. Whatever. <laughs> and then Wade. Wade is the cop. Huang, I've got a plan that should draw the assassins out of their hiding hole. Come and see me at my place in Industrial. Heston. P.S. If you need a place to stay that's local, feel free to use my old safe house in South Bohat. Let's go to my boy Chang first. And I think the mission, honestly, I was stuck on was one of the FBI guys' uh, missions. Here we are. Huang Li, oh, so you're the one who lost my sword. My father's sword, and it was stolen. I knew your father. One doesn't like to speak ill of the dead, but in his case, I might make an exception. I've been unimpressed by you so far, and now my son tells me he had to save you himself in a recent ambush. Oh yeah, that's exactly what happened. Thanks, Chan, he's a brave and wise boy. My son is a cretin but also not your bodyguard. <laughs> you would show me proper respect by redeeming your shame. Now, get a fuel tanker and ram the ambushers gambling den. I want them to burn. Do not fail us again. Uh, no, I don't owe you anything, old man. I've come here, been mugged, robbed, and put up with morons telling me what to do. Go fuck yourself. Your language is a little ar- 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 whatever. But I like your spirit, boy. How about if I say please? Then as long as you lay off all the bullshit about honor, I'll do anything you ask. Wang has to fucking stand up for himself and be like, Hey, listen, you cunt. Your fucking son is a retard. <laughs> Take the gas tanker. If I don't fucking crash into one of the pumps. Alright, another mini game. Let's see. I don't think this is any different, however. To the usual one. Perfect. Drive the tanker to the gambling den. And the cops are on me. Hopefully they don't blow up the tanker. The tanker's leaking gas. Get to the gambler before it ignites. Well, that's not my fault. I am here, I believe. Fuck that shit. Okay, I jumped out. Damn. Cash. Is that the mission? Okay. 300 bucks for that as well. And there's a drug dealer here. Maybe he has something to offer us. Again, it's coke, but I'll make fuck all profit. He literally called me the F word. Okay. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> that wouldn't pass by now if they put that in a game. That's what's funny. Email from Chan. Literally subject bitch. Wang, we've got big problems. Come over right away. I'll be in my penthouse. Actually, I believe I'm closer to... Actually, you know what? The way I'll do these missions is if there's like Chan missions, I'll do all the Chan missions until his icon disappears and then I'll do another character because if I just switch between, I get lost like story-wise and you guys probably get lost story-wise, so that's the way I'm gonna do. What's the mission name? Sources. That bitch has betrayed me. How could she treat me like this? I thought we meant something to each other. What did Mel, the media whore, do now? Channel 15 have gotten Mel's show a lot in its schedule, but that bitch isn't going to edit out our names and faces. I mean, who could have seen that coming? Seriously, a journalist that lies? Is anything sacred? Nothing. Oh, don't you start, Mr. Fucking Know-It-All. Do us all a favor and put your massive head to work. Figure our way out of this. It's easy, Mara. We, we go over to Channel 15, grab her tapes, and kill her. She may have betrayed me, but... All the tiny veiled flirting. The hinted promise of tender romance. The hours spent together online. M-M-O-G-ing. It can't be for nothing, no. Here's my plan. Get over to Channel 15, grab her tapes, and take her to the dock compound in, Co in Hove Beach. Go to the TV, hurry up, now broadcast 13.30. The TV studio's front entrance is locked and security around the side looks tight. Maybe there's an easier way in. 
Smash the door locks to enter the TV studio. I can come here. Like this. Uh, smash this. Okay, this is easier than I thought. Uh, what the hell are the security guards in this place? Where the hell are the security guards? Would you want me to defend yourself against the security guys? Oh god. She came in here with flashbangs and shit. I guess what I have. I hope I don't die. I'd love to throw a grenade, but I forgot how to. Yes, I need that armor. Come on, yes. Oh Christ, don't kill me. Uh, melee weapon, do not kill her. Am I gonna pick her up or not? Oh, I am actually. If I go to all the trouble of carrying this idiot to the docks and Chan just shoots her, I'm gonna be so pissed. But then if he doesn't shoot her, I'll be even more pissed. Either way, it's a lose-lose situation for you, Hwang. You're getting no pussy at the end of the day. I'm trying to catch up with this van, but it's proven to be rather difficult. Especially since Huang can't actually fucking shoot properly. Fucking, and then there's another van in the- Oh, Jesus. Okay. Our van is in good fucking condition. Meet Shen at the dog compound. Uh, what is he gonna do with that container? <laughs> Is he just gonna ship her away? Why, Malay? Why did you betray me? I give you access to my whole operation. We had an agreement. I thought you were different, different. I thought we had something. We do. That's why you need to understand. This is all Huang's fault. What? No, it's not. He made me feel bad about myself, so I, I had to show him. Had to show me what? That you're a sellout bitch? You were planning this from the beginning. Chen, you're a fool for ever listening to her. A fool? Yes, a mad, crazy, rigorously handsome, on the world god of a fool, but it was all for love. Ah, oh, for fuck's sake. The love betrayed me, broke my tender heart in two. I don't want to kill you, Melaine, but what choice do I have? You want to be the boss? Then be the boss. You don't have to do anything you don't want to do. You've got the tapes. I can't hurt you without them. You could just let me go. Let you go? I, I know you want to. Yes, but... They'd say I was being soft. You're the boss, not them. It's not as simple as that. Shut up. I'm the boss. Me. I do what I like. When I like. How I like. We have the tapes. You're harmless now. Everybody will understand. Go, just go. You shoot her? Oh, he did. He shot her? I mean, that's what it looked like. I believe he shot her. There was a drawing that was supposed to appear before her on the ground, but I somehow skipped it. I don't know how, I just pressed A once. All right, well, there you go. Okay, yeah. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, get the mission. Yeah, this is, this is where I was stuck, I think. One of, one of this dude's missions, I recognize this now. So we might be actually close to overtaking my fucking initial Nintendo DS run. Is he gonna sneak up on me? The assassins that took your city so are in all probability- Okay, thanks for letting me read. Those Koreans have been loyal to our family for years. They wouldn't betray us. Newsflash, amigo. They don't want to be triad bitches no more. They want to be daddy. They want independence. And their assassins are gonna make sure they get it. By stealing Yujan, they took it to upset Sheen and disrupt his relationship with your uncle. And in order to upset them right back, I've planned some smack from a little personal stash I keep in one of their cars. A personal stash of smack? You're a junkie? No, I'm not a junkie. I'm a hypocrite, <laughs> which is much worse. I only use on weekends, though. Uh, 
Hey, walk a mile in my shoes, buddy. I don't need your shit. If, if we're gonna draw out these Korean assassins, make sure the LCPD bust his car. Well, the cops are right here, so... Gun! Parking contractors are towing away the Korean's car. What do you want me to do? Stop the truck. Stop the fucking- oh shit. Why is it on fire? That's gonna blow up the truck. Fuck. There's just taxis here. Shit. Get the fuck out the truck, man. Fuck's sake, this car. Pull over, man. Look, he's just pushing all the cars to this- oh shit. To the side. Stop this fucking truck, you maniac. God damn it, I don't have enough time to just get out and get in the truck. I'm trying to stop it, it's really hard. Oh! Great opportunity. Can I get in it? There you go. Get the truck driver off. Get out of the vehicle. Shit. Go to the side of it. He's beating the shit out of me. He might kill me. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Get the fucking car. Come on, come on. Oh, for fuck's sake. Uh. Fuck's sake. Okay. I'm safe from the cop, I think. He's glitching out. Get a two-star wanted level. I think I can get one by just fucking killing one of the cops, yeah? I'm trying to run him over. Okay. Leave the car outside the police station. Are they just not going to chase me? Oh, well, I guess they won't. There you go. Another mission passed successfully. There's also these calls. I'm not going to do these. I'm sorry. It's just a big, huge waste of time. I just want to pretty much show off the story in my Let's Plays. Um, sadly, not like Chuck O'Connor, where I literally do every fucking thing. Framing that Korean gang banger has severely de depleted my personal stash. I need you to get hold of two bags of coke and bring them over as soon as possible. I usually get mine off the Angels of Deaths in Willis. It's, it's purely for recreational purposes, of course. My wife left me. I'm kind of a tragic figure. They should make a movie about me as a sad, corrupt cop with a drug problem. I'm one of a kind. Okay, this is the mission I have problems with. So we pretty much caught up to my Nintendo DS run. Um, which is dope. What, what's funny is, you know the last episode where I like failed every mission? There's game states in this. <laughs> so I could like start a mission, get to a certain point, and if let's say I die, I do the mission again, I can save before I die. And not have to do the whole thing again which is dope but i don't think i'll do that um rather have like more of a authentic experience it'd be an authentic experience if i actually bought a psp and bought this game uh but then i would need a capture card and then uh i'm a pussy anyways holy shit too that's yeah that's gonna cost all my money take me later come back and maybe we'll hang out you know what i'm saying fuck off i ain't doing coke with you Edmundo, bro. Of course, it's a bus. I might take everything from my stash, though. Oh, I have five coke. I didn't even know. Holy shit. So I can, so I can literally get my money back. Hopefully, I still don't have the cops on me. Okay. Wait, should I actually sell this stuff? I guess it doesn't really matter. Man, this apartment shit. <laughs> For profit, it's still a hundred bucks though. Acid. Holy shit, profit of four. Oh yeah, because that we got the acid for free from that one mission. Fuck it. It's probably a mistake selling that, but whatever. And then Coke. I'll get profit also. Dope. 
All right. Here we go. The tail bagging the bots. I think that's the mission then. Well, you made it in the end. Don't worry about me. I'm just climbing the wall here. I've scratched myself for all over. And I mean all over. Nice. It's real family. It's family fun hanging around. Okay, whatever it said. Kid, keep up the patronizing tone. Really symp sympathetic of you. I'm a good cop sometimes. Anyways, the next time I want a morality lesson for the son of a dead gangster, remind me to ask for one. Talking of tax dollars, the LCPD just put some to good use by releasing that Korean with a fucking caution. Man, if they find even half that amount of drugs in my car, I'd lose my pension. In this country, only the president can boast about getting high. They let you off without even a slap wrist. Are you shitting me? Cops always look after each other. Not me. Internal affairs are kicking my ass day in, day out. They don't seem to appreciate that to get results, you've got to bend the rules a little. Just like in the movies. Tough cop uh, goes it alone. That's me. Absolutely. Exactly how I would describe you. What are we going to do about the Korean prick? <laughs> Well, he's gonna have to explain himself to uh, all his underbosses for getting arrested. Why don't you follow him and introduce yourself to all of them? If that doesn't get their attention, I don't know what will. You're using me as bait? You wanna catch the big fish? You gotta put a worm on the line. No offense, Huang, I just, wa I just always wanted to use that line. Uh, now talking of lines. <laughs> okay, give me that coke. Uh, go to the police station before the... Uh, Korean gang gets released. I'm still driving this shit taxi. Follow the Korean. Can I stay close or? Okay, yeah. Uh, I cannot. The Korean is meeting an underboss in his gang. Take out the underboss before the Koreans drive too far catch up okay i don't know if i just wasn't able to get the coke or if i actually struggled in the, inside the mission itself i'm actually gonna save state just in case uh <laughs> fuck what i said before another meeting with the underboss After the Korean. This fucking taxi is gonna blow up at one point. He's talking to another gang underboss. Oh shit. Come on. Wait, I can actually just shoot them. There you go. Korean has stopped. He's groveling to yet another gang member. Or underboss, I should say. Uh, they know they're being followed. Take him out. Cool. Fuck back here. How's my car already smoking? Oh shit. Hopefully the explosion kills them both. I don't really want to get close. Okay, there's one guy left. He's dead, but the car is fucked! Come on! I oh, know there's actually one guy. Fuck, I don't want to get out. I want to drive back and shoot at him. And I killed a fucking cop, that's great. But I think my wanted level's gone, yeah? Okay. Alright, we got two new messages. Let's see what uh, these are. Oh, it's actually from Woo Kenny. Whoa, Kenny! Nephew, those Korean kids, the Midtown gangster, have been friends of our family for years. Your incessant attacks on them must stop. They're now so weak that they are being threatened and defeated by several of the city's more unpleasant Italian families. For, uh, for now, we must concentrate our efforts on our most virulent enemies, those moronic Hispanic lords. So yeah, we pretty much now advance forward to unknown land. I mean, not like... 
I actually remembered all those missions I just did. Like, I honestly didn't even remember there was a weed mission or anything. Like, that's how, like, long ago I played this game. Why am I still in this shitty fucking taxi? Which is good because I was actually, like, kind of petrified that uh, it's gonna be a mission I can't get past, but it doesn't seem like it. This game is very new player friendly, I guess you could say. Copter Carnage? Our noble house will come to a dishonorable end unless we defend ourselves. Absolutely. Also, if anyone ever seizes your hard drive or DVD collection, funny times to be cracking jokes, you little snot. You enraged the Spanish guards and now they're coming to try and destroy me. Yes, and it wasn't like you told me to attack them or anything, was it? I told you to deal with the problem. What a f great fucking job you did. Oh, I'm sorry, uncle. Sorry I came here, got robbed, mugged, left for dead, and that was the good bit. My father's death remains unsolved and I'm fine your fucking battles. Thanks, uncle. They're here. Deal with them, Huang. It's all your fault anyways. Damn. Oh shit. <gasps> I mean, that worked out well. Um, oh, it's actually lol. It's right bumper to lock on. I should pick up this armor. There's a chopper. How do I shoot the chopper? Hello? There's literally a chopper shooting the merchandise. What? Fucking hell. I did a save state right there because I have a feeling I'm gonna fucking die and have to do everything all over again. Because there doesn't seem to be any health pickups and there's a huge chopper shooting me as well. The Spanish lords are fleeing. Follow the helicopter. Okay, might not fail. Let's get this car. Damn, they have roadblocks and shit. You have found the Spanish Lord's warehouse. Safe state. Oh. Okay, well, that's just the mission. So we know where their warehouse is. I gotta drive all the way back to the same exact spot we were at. That's fun. Kenny strikes back. We have taught the Spanish Lords the error of their heaving ways. It's time to give them a lesson in the art of noble conduct. And trust me, my boy, nothing says nobility like murder, theft, and kicking someone when they are down. We will raid their warehouse, where their most valuable merchandise is. But unlike those thieving dogs, we will only take that which is rightfully ours. Then we'll destroy the place and kill a shit <laughs> lots of these bastards. Absolutely. What do you take me for? A metrosexual on a cleanse? Never, uncle. Do you think we will find that stupid sword? Yu Jiang with there? Maybe. Perhaps we should take everything, just to be certain. Uh, then destroy this place and kill a lot of them, just for good form's sake. We're gonna do that now. Oh, we are. But first, <laughs> let's go through the trash. We're a fucking gangster that just goes through trash and finds shotguns, fucking SMGs and shit. Oh, fuck. I didn't go to my where... I didn't... Oh shit, are they gonna give me armor? I realize, I came all the way here. Story Vine looks like an ideal target. Okay. Um, I didn't re read the rest, um, because I'm kind of worried about... Armor. Um, now, sadly, I do not know where there is armor. But maybe, if I'm lucky, some of these guys are gonna drop some. Uh, I didn't even heal or anything, so... Ugh. Oh, wait! Nice. <laughs> Can I just, like... Okay, no. I mean, that's a climbable fence. This one is not climbable, though. Open the gates! And I'm gonna do all this myself? How are the triads, like, not helping me? I guess, because, like... 
we're not technically part of the triads. We're just doing this for our uncle who wants to be the boss of the triads. Um, Spanish lords have spotted you. What was I supposed to do? Fucking sneak? I'm supposed to massacre all of them. Okay, there was not much resistance, uh, but I fear there is going to be way more resistance. Unless I just take the van, right? Uh, this... Boom, boom, boom. Yeah, there's more of them. He's closing the gate. Smart move, not gonna lie. Uh, take him out. I'm just gonna shoot at him. Behind... Get from behind the corner, you fuck. The gate is open. Leaving. Goodbye. Sayonara, as they say. Oh, the van is smoking. Please, no. Oh, we're right there. Dope. <laughs> Just <laughs> ran over one of our guys. Drive the van into Kenny's warehouse. Perfect. I thought that's going to be way harder, honestly. Nice, more drugs. Three coke, that's actually pretty good. Not gonna lie. Mission fucking passed, baby. Spanish Lord's Warehouse has been added to the poll menu in your dispute. You can return there and attempt to steal more of their goods. Damn! That's cool. I don't think I'll do that though. Uh because it doesn't it, it doesn't make it doesn't make much sense for me to go and like farm money, farm these drugs, sell these drugs and stuff, because like it's not much to do and to spend money. Like maybe if this was GTA 5, you know, that'd be dope. Like customize cars and shit. You can't do that here, so. Alright, here's a Fed again. If you're still alive, look me Huang. That the Korean midtown gangster haven't put some heavy killers on you tells me we're probably shooting wide of the mark. I've got a feeling their gang may have some issues with it. It's, uh, I've been doing some digging, but we need to get more reliable, uh, information. Come and see me. Oh, I'll come. <clears throat> what? Weapons of mass destruction. Do we get to use a minigun finally? How are you doing? Listen, if we are going to find out what the fuck is wrong with those Koreans, we're, go we're going to need some proper information. None of my contacts know shit about them. We need to put a bag inside a gang house. Sounds easy enough. Uh, maybe I should just walk up and ask one of them to let me in and plant it. I'm the one planting the bug, tough guy. I just need you to keep those low lives out of my hair for a while. You're insane! Why take such a big risk? Because... IAD are gonna shut me down unless I deliver a big collar. I'm a good cop, but I've been doing bad shit ever since. Never mind, I know of my annoying anico votes, whatever. Just create a diversion, Wang. And make sure it's a big one. Okay, I still can't read these fucking words they're throwing at me that I see for the first time ever. I'm actually gonna take this car. This is a Korean cars. Destroy one of the Korean cars to get their attention. Gotcha. Gonna shoot. Okay, just don't shoot the one that's like right next. Hello, anyone? Take out the remaining gang. I'm gonna stay in the car because it's OP. Uh, it's literally GTA fucking online with the fucking uh, Akuma is the car. The armored Akuma. I'm actually gonna go and pick up some of this ammo. Free ammo, hey man. I'm stingy as fuck in this game. Even more ammo, whoa! Attack creating bangers to cause more of a distraction. What's up, motherfuckers? Remember this fucking great duke. It's gonna hunt you for the rest of the, of the lives. Can I actually shoot this bastard? Okay, just beat the shit. Doing the same exact thing. We need to distract. Holy shit, there's a lot of them actually. They might actually explode my car. Um, there's a wall. I'm gonna risk getting out. Fuck, just mauled them with the AK. Lure them to a more remote location. Gotcha. This is kind of fucking. A lot of people living here. 
Uh, and I believe my car is gonna explode at one point of this mission, but that's fine. But this is not like GTA 3 where I literally failed missions because my car just set on fire and the game gives you like two seconds for you to react to get out the car and then run away from the car, which is, as you can see, not enough. Or well, now you can see, but like, you know, if you play GTA 3, you know. Even in the fucking definitive edition, get into a boat. Oh shit. <laughs> Fuck a P.O. Fuck a piss test. Oh, that's it? Oh, I'll just change radio, man. The mission finished? Okay. Wait, blog pa- uh, Blog pant- Blog- Blog- Bant <laughs> is what I was gonna say. Oh my god. Uh, Huang, planting the bug was supposed to have been the dangerous part of the mission, but I had it easy thanks to your fireworks. You're one crazy son of a bitch, Huang. I'm starting to like you. Fuck off. Uh, Kenny, success. Well done, Huang. You have dealt our true enemies a crippling blow. For the first time, I was truly proud to call you my nephew. Previously, I was just... Uh, I have to just s said I was proud. Okay. Uh, but really been sort of embarrassed by you. But not today. P.S. I don't think you recovered Juwang this raid. Clearly, further raids will be necessary. Here's a first in the Let's Play. Me riding a fucking bike. Holy shit. Holy shit. God damn. <laughs> it's so fast. Oh, fuck. Not another step, punk. Guess what? I'm in a fucking car. Go fuck. Okay. No. <laughs> Oh, one want to allow uh, forces will try and arrest you. Did they take my guns? If you're arrested, you will be taken to the nearest. The officers there will confiscate your weapons and take... No way! That is so unfair. Can I, like, go back? I mean, I can go to this. Oh, I should have saved right after the mission. Guys, that's fucking bullshit. I lost all my weapons. Whatever. I'm just going to buy new ones, I guess. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching whatever the fuck this part is. We are 22% done with the game, so we're getting there. And, you know, GTA games, they have a bunch of collectibles and shit to do. So, you know, 22% doesn't mean we're 2 tenth. I don't know how to say it otherwise. Uh, basically, we're not 20% done with the game. We're more like maybe 50 or something. Um, because, you know, I finished GTA 5 at like 69%, which was funny. Um, or was it 50%, 69%? Around there. It wasn't like 100%. So there's definitely a lot of collectibles and shit to do in this game. I'm not going to do all of it because I only do like 100% runs like in my spare time because it's just, I don't know, it's kind of fun. But not all games, you know? Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace.